Ready? Here we go. Uh, I'm Richard D. Thompson, director. I'm Sanford L. Moore, music director. And my name is Gary Q. Lewis, and I'm the choreographer. How did this come about? Uh, well, I was talking with Sanford one day, and he said, boy, wouldn't it be fun to do a show with just all men? So we started talking more, and eventually we came down to this notion of songs from the 60s and 70s, R&B, soul. Then came the notion of a barber shop, and, and then things just kind of kept rolling from there. Many notes, many cassette tapes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'll say. And LPs. Mm -hmm. More contemporary sounds aren't as poetic and or sophisticated in that way, in my opinion. You want to talk a little bit about the barbershops? Yeah, I went to the barbershop a lot. <laughs> <laughs> the most successful business in the African American community are barbershops and hair salons, historically. And that's still true today. Fortunately, unfortunately. But as a result of that, it's be they've become gathering spots for the community, where people gather, not only to get themselves in a different state of mind by feeling better, as we all know, and people do now going to salons, as it were. But it was a place to exchange information. You know, you play a lot of different styles in the course of the show. A lot of, if not all, of these groups have some affiliation with church. They came out of church, and um, it's kind of an interesting cycle because this music really has its roots in the gospel and in the church, um, African American religious music, and um, so. And I guess for me, this, I don't really distinguish the styles. I mean, even though you can um, intellectually blues and you know jazz elements and R and B. You know, when you think of the song, if you don't know it by now, you know, I'm trying to t tell them, you guys are, this is a church song. I mean, this is a gospel song. Because we can go back to when there was quote unquote race music and then other music, you see. But for us, it was the music of our community. Um, I want you to talk about all these different dances that are in here. When I heard this music, which I, I grew up on, the dances just came back to me. And that's why when you look at the audience, they know it. They do it. In their seats, they'll do the arms. And they'll do everything. The same vibe, the same bop to it, because people want it, need it, love it. And it's the right time for it to be happening again. 